United States Navy, uh, 24 years, one month, and eight days, uh, over a 37-year period, 1963 to 2000. U.S. Army Artillery, uh, 1957 to 1959, Cold War Germany. Just ROTC in college, and uh, Kenya and uh, chemistry. Military wanted me to do chemical and biological yes. warfare. Yes. In 1965 oh, okay. 67, the US Navy Submarine Force, third class quartermaster, submarine qualified. No. Thank you. Vietnam, 65, 66. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Tom Wilzak, uh, United States Army Corps of Engineers, 21 years. Okay, when'd you get out? I got out in 1988. Went in and uh, the buildup of Vietnam in 1968. Long time. A little butter bar when I went in. Bob Wilco, U.S. Army, E-5, 1969 to 1971, Vietnam, 1970, 1971. September 66 to September 69, was in the Army, Signal Corps in Germany for two and a half years. Didn't do anything, I was worth my
one is it's got little rotating props on it so I can spin it from right yeah, to water. Yes, you can. The only way you get it to turn fast is I give you a little gas. It's easier without machine guns. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Master three? That's right. That is me. Steve Benneke. That is me. Okay. Steve Benneke, the National Society of the Daughters of the American Revolution, of the Rochelle, join a grateful nation in honoring you for your service in the United States Navy and the Vietnam War. And we thank you. Thank you very much. This is a certificate in recognition of your service. Very nice. Thank you. Is this the pin? Sometime during that Vietnam period. Were you in Vietnam? No. But that's okay. But that was in that period. That was in that period. Anybody served in that period, we want to recognize you because it was well. Not many were recognized. Thank good you. Days. And thank you so much and appreciate your service in our country. Thank you. And I'd like to present you with the. Okay. Thank you so much. On behalf of the Great Formation, we thank you for your service. Okay, the clamps on hook up. Clamps. Mr. Ron. 
Donald Jones. Right here. Okay. All right. <laughs> Well, not, whoops, I lose my balance on this. <laughs> well, I got we'll be together. <laughs> I know, Vietnam era people here. <laughs> anyway, the Daughters of the American Revolution want to acknowledge and honor you for your service to our country in the Vietnam War. And you were a, what's it, E T I P O I L P O. <laughs> yes. It's a lot. E T 1 is trying to take this in first class, P O 1 is petty officer first class, L P O is L. Lead petty officer. Oh, and that's were, a hard thing to get, lead petty officer. I have done. And you some were reading. in the service for how many years? Uh, a total of 24 years over a 37-year period. Well, thank you so much. And we thank just you. Honor you. Thank you. Your service, Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'd like to present you with the memorial pin. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Robert Welcome. Robert, we want to thank you very much for your service to our country, especially during the Vietnam War. It was a difficult time in our era. Um, you are an E5, I know that's some classification for uh, your service in the Army. It's a technical sergeant. A technical sergeant. In other words, uh, technically you know all the stuff you need yes. to know to be that sergeant yes. and make them work out well. Yes. Very well. <laughs> yes. Well, we thank you for that. Thank you. Because you get them out of high school and oh my, I can only imagine. So, uh, thank you for your valor of service. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Welcome. We're going to have to go to the left. Remember that. Go to the left. Five seconds. Five seconds. Get ready. Lieutenant Colonel Thomas Wilsack. Well, Lieutenant Colonel. <laughs> <laughs> the John Wayne didn't know. Yeah, the John Wayne. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you so much, John. Thomas. Now you have the same John here yeah. um, for serving our country. Now, what would you say? I want to say there's more respect for one than another, but. In, in, a, in a real leadership position where you take a lot of responsibility for what goes on with, your, with the people that you are in charge of. I truly appreciate it. Uh, and, and I mean, we just have children to raise. <laughs> <laughs> They're tougher. They're tougher than. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and it lasts all, all your life. <laughs> <laughs> they don't go away. <laughs> they don't go away, no. But these do, and these, I just thank you for caring for them and caring for our country. Thank you very much. And I also have pins that family members can wear. And we'd like to get a group picture, and I'm going to do This is just a wonderful day. This is a day of honor, respect, and gratitude to those who give up their lives for our country. So let's pray.
Grand Haven, Grand Haven, Haven Veterans, 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 Club. Veterans Club. Grand Haven Veterans Club? Yeah. You're just not veterans? You... No, we're a veterans club. <laughs> the clubs oh. social. Listen, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The Lord, we honor our veterans, worthy men and women who gave their best when they were called upon to serve and protect our country. We pray that you will bless them for their unselfish service and the continual struggle. Bless them abundantly for the hardships they face, for the sacrifice they made, for their many different contributions to America's victory. Bless their families. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen.